Hi, today we'll be exploring how to craft prompts for AutoDraft AI. AutoDraft AI enables animators to create animation assets for their videos in a consistent style with a variable degree of control on the background, and you have hundreds of consistent styles to choose from. But to get the best results from AutoDraft, we need to understand some basic rules for writing prompts. Let's dive into these rules. But first, we must always follow a basic prompt structure in AutoDraft to get the best results from the AI. We should always write prompts as short scene descriptions, followed by all its additional components, and end it with modifiers like masterpiece. For example, here I have a sample prompt. A girl sitting in a park, trees, bushes, clear sky, clouds, sun, masterpiece. In this sample prompt, the scene is a girl sitting in a park, the additional components are trees, bushes, clear sky, clouds, and sun. And masterpiece is the only modifier I have added. We must always follow this basic structure of prompting for all functionalities of AutoDraft AI with the prompt structure in mind. Let's discuss the basic rules of prompting. The first rule is to describe the output image only. Always describe the image you want the model to generate, regardless of the features you use. Do not command the AI to make changes in the uploaded images. For example, change this image to black and white remove trees from this image, or add a house to the image. AI image generators do not understand commands, they only understand the image descriptions and give the best results when we clearly describe the output image we want the AI to generate. The second rule for crafting the best prompts is to mention all the elements that we want the generated image to have. For example, instead of just writing your prompt as a forest, you can write it as a forest with a large tree, a muddy road, a boat in a river, flowers, a large moon, and a starry night. As you can see, the generated image has all the elements that we included in the prompt. So, it's best to include all the elements that we want in the output image to be written in the prompt. The third rule for writing awesome prompts is to avoid writing unnecessary context in the prompt. As the models understand only image descriptions, the context of the image is not something the model understands and can lead to bad results. For example, the first prompt here has too much context which the model doesn't understand. The second and third prompts only describe the image we want to be generated, making it easier for the model to understand our prompt. Hence, we should avoid writing context into the prompt and only describe the output image. Another tip is to avoid writing negative keywords like no, not, without, neither, in the prompt. We should try to write the same prompt positively to get the best results from the model. For example, instead of writing a prompt like a man standing on a beach without a shirt, we should write it as a shirtless man on a beach. Positive prompts are straightforward and much easier for the model to understand, so always write prompts without negative keywords. The next rule for crafting good prompts is to use descriptive keywords, which means we should add more keywords that further describe our subject or scene to get the output we want. For example, instead of writing an old woman as a prompt, we can write an old woman with wrinkled skin and gray hair. Adding more descriptive keywords helps us to describe the characteristics of our subject and thus get a better result. The next rule in our list is to always prompt in English. If you are native to some other language or have a poor understanding of English, please use Google Translate to translate your prompts to English and copy paste them into AutoDraft. Writing prompts in English will help you get the outputs you desire easily. The last rule of writing good prompts is to avoid numerical values in the prompt. AI image generators do not understand numbers very well. For example, the model doesn't understand the difference between ages 10, 12, 14, 16 or 18. Instead of numerical ages, using descriptive terms like toddler, teen, young, middle-aged, or old to describe our subject leads to better results. So, avoid writing numerical values into the prompts and use descriptive keywords instead to generate beautiful images. Thank you for watching. Start generating backgrounds for your animations with AutoDraft AI's animation background templates today.